Tyler here with GP Knives, and we're back again for the weekly update. We're going to go small to large this week, and we're going to start out with this little guy. It is a Kiridashi Utility Knife from NCC Knives. You've got an O1 tool steel blade with a flame heated finish. So you've got the CNC lines on the chisel ground blade. Just a single bevel there with a slight micro bevel on the back. And we've got these in a variety of colors of G10. This is the toxic green. And it does come with a nice secure Kydex sheath for carry. Makes a great ultra light EDC utility knife and just an all around great knife. And also from NCC knives, we've got his pod, which is a friction folder. This one is in milled green G10 with a black G10 pivot collar on the opposite side. You can see the blade fits right into the groove on the G10 here for secure carry. This is a friction folder, and while it can be opened with one hand, it's really more of a two-hand opener. Again, chisel grind on this. You got almost an orange peel texture on the back with a tumbled finish on the front. Nice fuller there with the opening hole. And the blade is AEBL, which is going to have a very high level of sharpness, good corrosion resistance and toughness, and just a great little EDC knife. And again, we do have these in multiple handle colors. We've got green and black G10 and carbon fiber. For those who are into a more traditional style knife, we've got a bunch of patterns of case knives in this black canvas micarta handle. So it's going to have the same case bow tie shield here. A nice light texture on that canvas micarta. A really good look and a lot of traditional patterns on this. And these are going to be in cases True Sharp stainless steel. And next up we have the MSF from Tops. And this is their new Scandi folder. This is made by Mazarin in Italy. You've got a blade of N690CO. So a really nice working steel. I actually like this steel quite a bit. And this has a very interesting tumbled finish on the flats. Satin on the Scandi grind. Good thick stock on there, but still thin enough for slicing. And then we've got stainless steel liner construction a deep carry stainless steel pocket clip that can be reversed and some really nice canvas micarta handles smooth operation it is a ball bearing pivot flipper and you can see that the deployment on that is fast and smooth next up we have the mini presidio 2 the upgraded version of the original presidio we've got a different texture on the aluminum scales here same stainless steel liner construction Got a nice deep carry clip, S30V blade steel, and of course the axis lock operation. Good solid four finger grip on this, and just another great hard use, but compact EDC folder. And another knife from Benchmade is the new 495 Vector Flipper. This is an assist open flipper. You got the same axis lock construction, kind of a dagger grind here. It is just a single edge, but you've got that nice full deep grind on the back there thinning to a nice fine point got s30v blade steel on this again contoured and textured g10 and a deep carry pocket clip reversible on that as well and it does have the built-in safety for the axis lock there so a bit larger but still very functional and a little more refined in the aesthetic we also have the 0462 from zero tolerance this is a Dmitry Sinkovich design. You've got a blade steel on this one of CPM 20 CV for optimal edge retention and corrosion resistance. Nice satin finish, no logo on the front there. You've got red and black, a little bit of a style upgrade from the copper and black of the 0460. This one has the KBT ball bearing pivot system, titanium frame lock, you've got a matching tie clip, and this one has internal milling for weight reduction. It's a bit larger, as you can see, but 
thanks to the slim profile, still makes a great everyday carry folder. And another one from ZT, an oldie but a goodie, is the Zero Tolerance 0301. This is a Ken Onion and Mick Strider design combo. You've got the tiger striped blade in CPM S30V, great contoured and textured G10 titanium frame lock. This one is the upgraded version with the stainless steel lock face insert that doubles as an internal over travel preventer. And you've got a four position clip on this one. So restock on that as well as the 0303, which is the all black version. And finally, we have the new Fieldcraft holder from Tops. This is based off of the Brothers of Bushcraft Fieldcraft knife. Same construction with the 1095 blade, canvas micarta handle scales. This one has a stainless steel liner lock construction. It's a very robust knife. And this one carries via a reversible tip up stainless steel pocket clip with black traction coating or with the included leather belt pouch. Again, this is Tyler with GP Knives and your Week 9 2018 weekly update. Thanks for watching and stay sharp. If you like what you've seen today and you'd like to see more, check out the rest of the videos on our YouTube channel, like the video below, and click the icon at the bottom right hand corner to subscribe to our YouTube channel feed for updates on all new videos.